internships and all these different jobs, how you get the interview. So I will segue it over to our lovely Leslie. Yes. All right, guys. So now you found the job, right? You've landed this interview. So here are some key tips and tricks to ace that interview. First things first, aim to connect, not to impress. Come prepared to discuss trends in the industry. Mm. Be sincere with your answers and listen, just be authentic. Don't feel like you have to showbo, you know, I do this, I do, no, just lead with confidence and just, it, that will put you on the right path. And then communication is key. During an interview, especially now that I've transitioned into the operation side, I do a lot of interviews and communi- I try to set the tone in the beginning because, you know, I don't like my interviews to be very tense. It's already stressful. So, you know, communication is key. You want to judge hiring. Ah, hiring managers are judging less of what you say, but more how you say it. Tone is everything. Are you coming off polished? Are you coming off confident? Or do you feel a little staggered in your answers? So you just want to really own the way you speak. And I cannot, cannot ugh, research, research, research. First interview I ever had at Laugh Out Loud, I researched the company, I researched the founders, I researched the person I was interviewing. I was like, okay, Laugh Out Loud, what, what, what are they about? I researched their mission, their values, and most importantly, I watched their content because I can't tell you how many times I've interviewed people and I just throw a curveball like, so what do you like on Laugh Out Loud Network? What, what, what is your favorite show? And people are like, uh, uh, do not do that. I'm telling you, even if you have to watch 10 minutes of something that you're like, I don't know what this is, watch it, get the knowledge, check out the company's website, including their social media pages, look on their LinkedIn, check Glassdoor. There are so many resources around you for you to do research. And then most importantly, back up your answers with real life examples. Don't don't go in thinking, okay, I can answer this. Go in thinking, how can I ex- give an example that I can do this? You know, we know you can do the job. We just want to know, have you done it before? It may not have been in this industry, but tell us time where you had to overcome something at school, over t- something you had to overcome in a relationship. Real life examples puts a person in front of you and you want that. You want, you want to connect with that person. Mm-hmm. Then come to interviews with specific answers and questions. So you want to ask questions that self that set yourself apart from other people. You don't want to go, so why did you da da da? You want to ask questions that are deeper than that. You want to think deeper and you want to go very, very deep. Then most importantly, send a thank you email. Oh my goodness. I can't tell you how many times I've had an interview with someone who I was just like rock star and I didn't receive a thank you. And I'm just like, no, that's, that's, hmm. I'm telling you from real life experience, it's, it takes two seconds. It takes two seconds of your time and it makes the difference between getting a job and being passed on. And then after that, once you've sent your thank you, do not hesitate to follow up guys. The funny thing about Laugh Out Loud, I probably chased this job for three months. I went through so many loopholes on interviews and it was my consistency, my persistence and my passion for this job that actually set me apart from everyone. And Shane, Shane Norman, shout out to you. You always let people know, you know, she was consistent. She, we interviewed her three months ago and she's still following up because I knew that I wanted to align with this company because they align with my values. So remember guys, go in confident don't feel like you have to overshow anything just be yourself all right so once you've landed this interview now we've got the job so kayla's going to show you how to excel in that position